www.newtheboss.com This is again Ty and in this video I'd like to share to you or help you out on how you can upgrade the firmware or the build of your Cherry Mobile Flare. Uh, it's prior build was uh, 22 and we're going to upgrade that to version 37. What you'd want to do first is you'd want to go to um, Cherry Mobile website. You gotta type in uh, cherrymobile.com.ph, and uh, if you don't have a link, it's on the description right below. You can just have, I mean, you, you just can click that, and it would take you straight to some nonsense, a uh, directory content software update uh, flare. Um, this would be an official update for flare devices or. Uh, chair mobile flare and you have two mirrors in there I mean one uh, base link and one mirror site it says software update flare download update it's either you can get a download from here or from the other you you can try if this one is taking too long and, and you can just try the other one uh, it would just be the same and you have all the instructions in there you won't go wrong uh... this is where i uh... let me just here number two and number three what you have to do here uh... press and hold power volume up for a few seconds it will display first a green screen what i did was release that instantly you don't have to release it you have to release that hold again hold power button plus volume up you have to release it after it changes to a red screen alright so it's just a little reminder in there that you have to read all these first right here or you have to watch the video thoroughly first before following alright so you don't go like one two and haven't read the, the, the rest of the instructions yet which what I did well anyway, yeah, so <laughs> right now we're gonna start off after you have it downloaded, it's on my uh documents already. What you'd have to do is to connect your uh flare to your USB uh connector and one end goes straight to your computer. Let me just show that to you right here let me just demo everything so you have to, I mean you just have to follow and it would be easy on your part connect one end to your flare and connect one end to your PC just like a normal uh, I mean a standard way of transferring files from a, a PC straight to a phone but here you have to bring notifications panel down and uh, something says turn on USB storage you have to uh, tap on that and it should turn orange I mean it's just some something like yellowish or orange uh, to know that USB storage has been activated already it's just going to display in there but just to make sure you have to re-verify and uh, folders right here would uh, flood up on your desktop on your computer I mean uh, you got two in there F and G so you just have to find your SD card again you have to find your SD or external uh, card your external memory card so let's have it right here this is what we got for the external card and um, yeah what you just have to do from here is go to your desktop back again then look for the file that we did save uh, after downloading okay so here the file that we have what you'd want to do with that is just simply drag that hold click drag that to the folder of your phone that says uh, external SD card or your external storage so you can just drag that in there right outside just on the root of your SD card it's gonna be an upgrade uh, somehow this upgrade says so that uh, it would fix the video, the inverted video on video chat, like what I experienced with Skype. Uh, if somebody would call you and then you're going to activate video calls, 
your video on your end would look inverted. We uh, I've tried that, but on the other end, the person you're chatting with, uh, she or he is seeing that correctly, right? No problems on her side, but on your side, your video is a little inverted. But now, uh, hopefully, after applying the fix, it says so in there, and this is going to fix everything. And also, it's going to add uh, an FM radio. For the build, for the 22 build, you don't have an FM radio in there. I'm not pretty sure what others you could get. And some, some would say it m makes it a little bit smoother. And some also said that those who upgraded already, they said that this upgrade would somehow uh, make minimal, I mean, discharges from the battery. Like, uh, the applications would drain your battery a little of an increment so your battery would somehow last a little bit longer with the update and um, yeah if, if you know something else maybe you could just add that on the comments below because I'm not really pretty familiar uh, right after you upgrade I'm, I'm gonna try and see what changes would happen I'm just gonna blog that you can just check that out on www.newtoboss.com and I'm gonna list that in there all the things that I would see and uh, probably it would help you in some way and after you did that what you want to do is close all the folders and um, go back to your phone what you want to do is to turn off USB storage from there it's, it says turn on right now so what you want to do is turn off and we're going to remove the cable here are we I mean here we are now on the phone I'm going to show you the power button right here All right so again power button right on top what you're going to do is turn that off first power off the device you have to turn it off because we are going to boot from from uh, from stationary no active applications running So there you go and here on the left side you have your volume rocker up and down I mean down and up and right here is your power button all right so what you want to do is hold them together just the power I mean the volume up and the power button again volume up on the left side power button all together hold it and don't release it all right don't release it just wait up a little bit. It's going to turn green. Okay, don't release again. Let's just, let's just keep that in there. Just keep it that way. And there you go. It should turn red in there. And remember, don't release up until it's red. All right, so it's going to turn right here. It's going to show you an Android uh, robot right there. And here, let me close up a little bit. Uh... You have on the left side your volume rocker again. That would help you navigate up and down. We're going to say apply update from external card. I mean external source. And um, there you go. You got your MSN. We're right now looking at the contents of your external card. Right? Your memory card. So that's the zip file we downloaded from the Cherry Mobile website. What you do to confirm, press the power button. After you press it, it's going to show you something that says uh, install from external card. Let's wait up a little bit. There you go. Uh, finding update package. Opening update package, verifying update package, install an update. Uh, I'm not pretty sure how long this would take. Uh, but I'm going to try to hold it in my hands. Uh, maybe 10 minutes. 20. Uh, 30 minutes. No, there you go. It's trying to move. I suppose uh, 
Oh, there you go. Install from SD card complete. So what you're going to do, you, you're going to see back uh, that blue text right in there, right on top. And this time, what you're going to look up for is something that says Reboot System. Now, let me just uh, navigate down so you would see that option clearly. Reboot your system now. Uh, up and down for navigation. Confirm using the power button. Then it should... Yeah, let's press that. It should... Uh, should reboot now. Okay. Oh yeah, it's it's uh, restarting. So for those people who's being asked to like uh, so be in Pilayo and then fall in line and wait up for for a technician to update your flare, maybe you can just follow this uh, tutorial. You can just do this at home. You, you don't have to to wait up for for quite a time and spend time for the technicians to do this for you. Okay, let's unlock and let's go to settings and see what we have in there. About phone. Oh, there you go. 37. Again, before the build was uh, version 22. That's the prior build. We got current build right now, which is at 37. And this update says so that would bring uh, FM radio. Uh, change the invert, I mean the axis maybe of the camera when doing video chat and uh, help out in the battery life. No, not life, but battery charge and discharge. Uh, where is the, that radio? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, FM radio. Let me zoom in here. Got FM radio right there. I can't reach for uh, for a headset. Uh, let me just open that. It says, please plug in wired headset. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to show a separate video on how the FM radio at face would look like. I can't, I can't move right now because the tripod is right between my knees. I can't grab a headset close to me. Uh, okay. Yeah, so that would look like that. You got your phone upgraded. To version 37, which would somehow uh, fix some issues and um, make your phone more solid for spending 3999 for a Cherry Mobile Android phone. So, wrong, Sulit. Yeah, please do subscribe to our channel to help us make the channel grow and also do visit our website www.newtoboss.com. Again, my name is Ty. Thanks much for watching the video.